Hello guys, me Carlos Santos, aka Happy Carlos Nine, and I, this is a game I haven't played in a while. It's a racing genre. It's called F1 2018, and I'm gonna do a video compilation of my race from the Australian Grand Prix. So it's located in Melbourne, Australia. So gotta mention that because I want to know how well I do and. How I was able to stay in the front. So I started on the pole, and one of the Ferrari drivers just flat out like took the lead from me and was wasn't able to get it back. So oh well, I've had to do a few rewinds or flashbacks because I just wanted to get rid of all the crashing I've done since my upgrades or my R&D upgrades I just couldn't handle the stress of you know steering counter steering you know and that's what I kind of struggle on in these F1 cars so. so this is still lap one you know so let me see here. As, I, as you can tell, yeah, I just basically lost touch with the Ferrari cars of Vettel and Raikkonen. And so while I was at it, I just kept on grinding and held up the guys behind me. And, and hopefully it led to a podium finish so I don't want to spoil it but I had the driving equipment that was so slow that I had to maintain that third place that I've like held the majority of the race so yeah it involved one pit stop so one pit stop was enough to make all them adjustments and put some medium or hard compound tires on there and hopefully gain the leader a little bit but I told you I wouldn't give up on it but just one second guys let me do Part two of the Australian Grand Prix. So I got three parts. The start of the race, how I was able to cycle out in the pit during the pit stops, and how I was able to hold on to third at the end of the race. So spoil. <laughs> you guys want to know how I how how well I finished? So. Oops. It wouldn't give me a copyright if it, like... I just wanted to turn it off because I don't want my commentating and the engine noise of the F1 cars to get in the way, so... So I learned a skill. Learned how to put a face cam on my iMovie, so... Don't have to upgrade my, uh iMovie settings just have the one that I have 10 years ago and build it off from there I kind of wish I didn't wear glasses but I have to lean towards the laptop a little bit to see where I'm running and how many laps to go so
which are the Mercedes drivers. Um, it's been an uneventful race. So, oh. and then I get the wall again. Use another flashback. And if I hadn't used the flashbacks, I would have retired from the race, or even still kept running. But I'd be in the back of the pack. I'm telling you. These kind of reference races are just hard to compete when you have like an endurance race and then you have to keep running and running until you get the best finish possible. Let's see. If you want to fast forward to the end of the race, go right ahead. But I will skip to the ending portion of the race and see what you guys think about the pit cycle that I went through. So, I'll catch you guys on the, during the end of the race. See ya! I didn't think that you'd see my uh, my pit cycle. I like, yep, this is lap six. I wanted to run another lap, so I'd been, so I'd have enough <laughs> gap between the guys behind me and the guys ahead of me 
which didn't matter that much, but I knew I'd hold everybody off behind me. So that's the pit cycle, so I'll skip to the inner race. So see, see you guys uh, in a few minutes. So we're in the end of the race. Um, lap 10 of 15 already. And uh, one of my nieces is sleeping. Her name's Alex. So I gotta be quiet because you know my parents. They want her to have a nice sleep. So I hope when they get older and I do more of these YouTube video contents based on my game racing game reviews. It won't be a factor, so yeah, she's still young. So nice to talk about family during an F1 game, don't you think? Yeah, these guys do it 21 race weekends a year, while for NASCAR it's just 38 weeks. It's just treacherous. And I mean, real treacherous. As I get too hesitant to look at my rear view mirror, I'm still in third place. And I think it's Max first stop, and that's not Max. Yep, no, not first stop, and it's Daniel Ricardo. Oh well. I'm trying to regain all my YouTube subscribers after they realize I don't didn't know how to do a face cam. So <laughs> just want to gain that core of audiences. So like I didn't want to do any special effects on the F1 replays because. All you're seeing is the cockpit view and all the telemetry that the game developer has uh, posted, like I'm, I'm, how fast I am, what my what lap I'm in, and what position. That's that's how you'll tell when how well I'm doing. So. If you, in the future, if you guys see me leaning too much to the towards the front, that means I'm actually trying to see how what my how many laps there are left and what position I am. So, trying to do this when having without having to wear glasses and stuff, since I don't want you guys to think I'm a geek or a nerd or something. I'm fine with it, but. Whatever it takes. And plus, 
I muted the music, background music so you guys have great content on how well I'm doing. So, yeah. I don't want to spoil it, but I did actually finish Dark so I'll end my commentary on F1 2018 for now. So I'm AK Happy Condonine. You guys have a good one. Bye.
So, here they come now, out onto the podium. Wherever you go after this round of the World Championship, here's how things look in the driver's table. Sebastian Vettel takes the lead of the driver's championship. Moving on to the driver of the day then, Anthony Davidson, who would you go for? Let's give it to Lance Stroll. That was a quality drive from start to finish. He can be proud of that one. On to the constructors then. Ferrari moved. Amazing performance out there. You must be really happy. You must be happy with the result today. It wasn't the cleanest race today, was it? We're coming to the end of my video right now, so... If you guys want to support my channel, Happy Carl9, give the thumbs up if you like the video, click on the bell button if you want to subscribe to more of my video content that I provided, and comment on the video that I posted below the description. So support my channel, Happy Carl9, and thanks a lot for watching my videos. So bye everybody and peace out. Thanks.